Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me walking on back with more Paper Mario. It's been a bit, but I'm back here to play, so let's get into it, huh? Okay, let me find a toad house. Hey, guess what? Somewhere in the desert, there's a stone cactus. By the way, if you'd like this, leave a like. If you move three south and two west from there, you'll find something special hidden. I'm not sure how to find it exactly, however, you should go there. Yeah? Yeah? Hey, wanna hear something else? I know lots of other stuff. Useful stuff, hey? Alright, let me switch over to Gumbario. These dry eyes looks like they're big hands because they're wrapped in cloth. It's hard to tell them apart since we only see their eyes. Damn, alright, slight racism there. Welcome, travelers. You must have had a long, hot journey getting here. Welcome to the Dry Dry Outpost. Mustafa is the leader of this. Mustafa is the leader of this entire town, so you better keep it in mind. Although you probably won't ever see him. Master Mustafa is the main man, yeah. Master Mustafa is the main man. Ooh. Where is the man? No one knows. He stays hidden from his foes. That's the dryad. The wind out here in the desert is full of staying in the air, so he protects himself by wrapping his face in a cloth. Since their faces are covered, it's tough to tell them apart. Sure, sure, they're all adults, though. He's a Nomadeus mouse. In Nomadeum. <laughs> He's a Nomad de Mouse who lives in this town. He seems to pay special attention to strangers like us. He belongs to some kind of shady organization. The organization rules Dry Dry Outpost. So mysterious and dangerous, I can feel my own screen calling. Mario, isn't this exciting? Are you aware that there's a dojo in Toad Town? There is! A while ago, I took one of the dojo challenges and did pretty well. I must say, I got a second degree card. You look pretty strong, so, huh? You haven't earned any cards? He's a dry hat. I've seen him in Toad Town. He earned himself a degree at the Toad Town Dojo. Have you seen the old fortune teller in Toad Town? He's always right, so his famous fortune telling is famous. If you had trouble in the middle of your adventure, it'd be a good idea to see him. This giant has been seen in Toad Town. Why does he look like he's worried about something? Whatever I worried, my Goompa always told me. When you're feeling lost, ask Merlin to show you the way. Merlin's fortune telling is surprisingly accurate. Thanks for telling me. Is that Mustafa? They just got jacked. Are you from Toad Town? Wow, that's a ways away. Try to try ruins. Nope, never heard of it. it sounds like it's local fairy tale or something. Hey, if you're serious about looking for Try Dry whatever, you should go ask the information trader. I suppose this information trader lives in town and swaps information for items, or something along those lines. That's what my friend says. Our friend? This guy? Nah, he's way too shy to be an information trader. Dryads look that he doesn't even bother them. I wonder why I'm boiling and they're all wrapped up in clothes? What gives? Maybe it's because their clothes are wrapped loosely. I could use some threads like that. Actually, I am curious about that. I wonder if it's the design of the clothes that makes it easier. I know it's to protect from the sun, right? Hmm? Are you addressing me? Composer am I? Writing songs will I try? <sighs> Wish you could find some lovely, heart-moving lyrics. I want to compose music filled with beautiful lyrics. It's my fondest wish. He's a toad in the desert. Sorry, this guy's music moved me to song. How about some karaoke? Just kidding. This composer sings pretty jolly, doesn't he? He makes me want to dance. He's a pretty jolly dude. I will give them that. Hey, hello! I'm assisting an archaeologist, Professor Colorado. I came to Dry Dry Desert to excavate the Dry Dry Ruins, but it's as hot as blazes every day and I'm constantly thirsty. I want to quit and go home. This is a Koopa Trooper from the excavation team. The team's assisting Colorado. That looks like hard work doing chores in this heat. Ugh. A brother and sister who are very close live atop Shooting Star Summit. The brother, Merlo, collects star pieces and will trade badges for them. The sister, in her love, is a fortune teller who will tell you where to find badges. I don't need some more information. 
Long ago, in this very land, there was a kingdom called Dry Dry Kingdom. King Mouster ruled over it. One dark day, he was betrayed by his subjects, and the uprising that followed Dry Dry Kingdom was ruined. You know, if <laughs> there is no betraying a king, if the king is not doing well by its people, then they get overthrown. That's the way it goes. I've never seen a king who was overthrown who was a good guy. <laughs> King Masta escaped and vowed vengeance on his enemies. He's gathered those faithful to him and defeated his betrayers. King Masta's supporters were originally robbers who built Dry Dry Outpost. See, look, if your team is with Robin dudes, I don't trust him. Yeah, take me up. Yep, sounds good right now, to be honest. Let's go. That's my cat race. Oh, Lord. Heard that an archaeologist named Colorado was around here looking for dry, dry ruins. You know what? Even if he digs up the entire desert, he won't find them. Where are you? Like the. That's a dry. It's hard to tell whether he's old or young because of that cloth around his face. Mario, I know how to tell you. Stop asking me about these damn fools. I have no idea who they are. Someone who gives things is nice. Yes, very nice. Nice guys get told nice stuff. I don't know. Mm, would you like a sleepy sheep? You're a very nice guy, you'll give me something more. Don't give anything. Goodbye. I need to go to the store and see what he buys. Ah, shit. I don't need to hear about your love for Merlot. Okay, let's see what he buys. Welcome, traveler. This is renowned Little Mouser's shop at Dry Dry Outpost. What can we interest you in? To claim? Okay. Hmm. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna see if I- I'm pretty sure what the answer is is dried shroom. And a um, thunderbolt, but I'm actually not 100% sure on that. So maybe if I look around a little bit. Keep this quiet. If this woman act casts a spell on you, it might help you during battle. For instance, your attack power might get stronger. You might get more coins for winning. Other stranger things may happen as well. But do not rely on this spell. By no means will it affect every battle. The spell can be beneficial, but it's also unpredictable. Hello, welcome. How are you? Feeling jolly? Feeling blue? I'm Merle, you see. That's me. A cuter gal you'll never see. I do magic, but not for free. Your luck has steered you well, but from... I am a master of the spell. When my spell upon you glows, you might get lucky, but who knows? Do you dare to take a chance? Do you want my card to dance? Yes. Oh, how lovely. Very good. Pick just one now, if you would. I'd pay as much as I could. Special course. Tally-ho! Here we go! Aw, oh, we're missing out on the special dance. Thank you. I think you'll find the power might get your foes to cower. It will light your darkest hour. Even should you meet the beast, do not fear, not in the least. My spell makes a famine feast. See you then. Please come again. Goodbye, my friend. That was fun. This is Shake. You'd think the guy would shake the dust from his clothes. Uh, if you didn't know he was an information dragon, so he would steer clear of him. So it was their best source for gossip and adventure who even deals with all kinds. Hmm. 
Did I go in here? Yeah, I did. So I wanted to go in here. Buddy, where are you going? He's shy, I guess, but I don't see any reason for him to be so timid. He is suspiciously timid. That's where the composer lives. Not there. Hmm. Let me save real quick. Alright, let's see if my order of things to buy was correct. I'm pretty sure it is a dried shroom and a thunderbolt. the sleepy sheep. Oh no. I don't want to sell anything more, man. Fine, here's an egg. Don't sell. God damn it. Don't sell. I'm pretty sure that's the option to buy things. Is a it's a dry shroom followed by a thunderbolt. Let's see if my memory serves me right from all those years. I don't know where you would find that combination now, but let's see if this works out. Oh shit, it was. <laughs> I guess I guess it was about dry dry how to get to the ruins. You must see Mr. Mustafa to find the resting place in dry dry ruins. Mr. Mustafa is a descendant of the great robber who built dry dry outpost. He is somewhere in the town, yes, but exactly where I only his close followers know. I could tell a secret, but only to the nicest of nice guys, yes? If you'll see can you understand more, ask more. Maybe it's just any two items, and I just give it to him. Egg. Favorite food? My favorite fruit starts with an L and ends with N. It's a yellow fruit, so sour. Such a nice fragrance, it's only in the desert oasis outside town. Oh, okay, so I need to get him my lemon. Enough. A lemon or a lime? Alright, let's go off and get them. We are now on lemon quest. Or lime quest. I forget, honestly, which one is which. <laughs> oh, wait. Quiz, everyone's favorite quiz master, Chuck Quizmo. Want to try the quiz? Yes. <gasps> then let's go to the question. Question: What is the name of Goombario's younger sister? Shit. It's Goombet, right? Damn it! That's the same question that I asked last time, and I didn't get it right. I think it's the same answer too. <laughs> Damn you recording literal months after first being asked. Alright. You know what? I need to go back. Because he told me exactly how to go there. Hmm. Was it not him? Was it you? No, it wasn't you. Okay, it's not you either. Not you. It's 
three south, two west. Okay. Three south, two west. Did I make it to the oasis already? <laughs> oh. Lemon. Now, if I remember right, there's also something here for... Yeah. Tax power goes up, dizzy shell, power bomb. I think I'm gonna go uh, bomb it. Yes. Next would be, I think, Goombario, just because I use him the most when I need to tattle on someone. Super rank. Cool. And here's this. Anything there? Nope. Same lemon and lime. the nicest of nice things. You have proven you're nice by giving me my favorite thing. And since you're nice, yes, I'll tell you something really nice. How to see Mustafa. To find Mr. Mustafa, go to the shop in this town. First buy a dried shroom, then buy a dusty hammer. Must buy them in the correct order, yes? Dried shroom and dusty hammer. This is the secret sign known to those loyal to Mustafa. If you buy these things in the correct order, the owner of the shop will let you see Mr. Mustafa. Remember, you must not buy them in the incorrect order. Enough. So I was half right. Thank you, sir. I was half right. I did remember it needing to be a dried shroom, at least. What ho, buying a dusty hammer after a dried shroom is a secret sign that only friends of Mr. Mustafa know. That means you're in with Mr. Mustafa. Hey, brother, good to meet you. Have you any questions you need answered? You want to see Mr. Mustafa? You're usually up in the highest part of the dry dry outpost. Just keep going up, my man. What does that mean? Can I claim my hunting back? Thank you. I have to go back, right? Because I feel like... He'll be gone. Yeah, okay. He's Mr. Mustafa. That is gonna be the reveal. Oh, there we go. Okay. I need to give that to the mouse over there. Hey, nice guy. We meet again. I'm glad you found me. <gasps> mouse reveal. I'm Mustafa. I'm the one you've been seeking all the time. When I'm out and about in Dry Dry Outpost, I use the name Sheik. It's always good to meet a genuinely nice guy. I meet people all the time, but you are by far the nicest guy I've met so far. Your name is Mario, yes? I heard that you want to go to Dry Dry Ruins. I have a feeling you are on an important journey, so I'll tell you the secret. Dry Dry Ruins is a very important place. My ancestors have watched over it for many generations. If I do not keep evil folk out of the ruins, who will? You must promise me that you will tell no one this secret. I'll give you this. The Pulse Stone. This Pulse Stone is the key to finding Dry Dry Ruins. 
Take it to the desert, yes? The pulse stone will flash above your head as you get close to the ruins. The closer you get to the ruins, the faster the pulse stone will flash. Follow where it leads you. Find the place where the pulse stone flashes the fastest and use it to open the way. Alright. Thanks, man. Sir. Is it not? Let me go to items. Toad Town. The letters say the traveling Nord Mouse on the road. Uh, well, yeah, I guess which in uh, which road, right? Maybe it's in this road? Let me go to items. I'm gonna go through the road real quick until I find... There he is. Traveling note of mice, correct? The name's Paracarry, I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Uh, another letter uh, duly delivered. A postman's job is never done. A letter to me from Mustafa. I've heard the name, but I can't remember who he is. Anyway, thank you for delivering it. I'm surprised you found me way out here. It's extremely hot traveling in the desert, so take care. Oh yeah, take this as my thanks. Don't hesitate, please take it. Thanks, bro. Pretty sure it's up here. Muscle memory. right here. Or I guess not. Come on. Yep, there it is. Fancy. Oh my god, oh my god. Whoa, bro. Yes. Nice guy. Yeah, pretty cool entrance. Now, the thing I don't remember is that is there a safe point here? Let's find out, huh? Because we are now. There it is. Bloom! scary to Tenkuba, remorseless king of the desert. Who dares set foot in this, my palace of the sands? Speak and be known. Be gone from this place now, where disaster will befall you. Well, we will work on that befalling next time. <laughs> but I'm gonna save here, and the next time we will beat this level. I'm pretty sure I can guarantee you we can beat this level in one episode. So until next time, everyone, thanks for sticking with me, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.